As Berkeley bans its overnight RV parking and San Francisco cracks down on overnight camping in its parks, more homeless people are moving to encampments in Oakland. You might be familiar with this one at the Home Depot. And one city council member is concerned that encampments like this are driving businesses out of Oakland. Meet Kay. She's the unofficial mayor of one of Oakland's largest homeless encampments. She's been living here behind the Home Depot in Oakland for two years. It actually has grown substantially within the last six months. There's no official count, but by the looks of it, at least 100 homeless people are now living in the sprawling shanty town located behind the hardware chain. Kay says its growth is tied to nearby encampment closures. And that's due to all the closures that has happened. 23rd was closed, so some of the people that didn't go to the tough sheds came here. Um, 66 was closed. She says people are also coming from other cities and even other states. That's because we're the only state that gives out money immediately. <laughs> Her neighbor, Elizabeth, moved in just about a month ago. She paid Kay $500 to live in this encampment on the street. Elizabeth lost her home to Hurricane Harvey and was living in a camp behind the Oakland Coliseum until the city shut that down. She says the nights are the worst when most of her neighbors are on meth. The humanity is not there no more. They, they don't care what they do, how they do it, who they do it to. She's already been robbed once, but even worse, she says the back of her house is being used as a toilet. Who is this? It's a situation she recently complained about to Oakland City Council the Member Noel go Guy. There. Public works will not pick up a trash. They will not service their public restrooms, so it's a mess. So the street behind the Home Depot where people have been camping is city-owned property. And Mayor Libby Schaff told us that she's going to petition City Council to secure funding to shut down this dead end street. She's promising a resolution to this. So Home Depot has summer. reported increased theft from people living in these encampments. It also says it's been dangerous for its suppliers to drive up here and drop anything off because of all the blight in this area. And to add insult to injury, the city has actually cited Home Depot because of all of the trash that's accumulated here. In Oakland, Susie Steimel, KPIX 5.